This is Fred Beck from Fred Talks Fighting, proudly sponsored by Empire Fight Store. I'm in Las Vegas today at the ABN Awards, joined by Johnny Sins. Johnny, it's nice to meet you for the first time. How you been? I've been great, man. It's nice to meet you. So, Johnny, this is my first time in Las Vegas. Unfortunately, I am 18 years old. What can <laughs> I do out here? Is there anything I can do out here? Man, being, being under 21 is pretty rough here. You can go to the strip clubs, All right, okay. the 18 and over strip clubs. You can't drink in them, unfortunately. So you'll be sober kind of walking around. But they are all nude compared to the 21 and over, which aren't all nude. So that's a plus. And I mean, you can still do, you can still go to all the casinos, do all that. You just aren't allowed to drink, I guess, or go into the or, bar. Or gamble. Gamble, yeah. You can't, you can't gamble if you're not no. 21? No, Ben, Ben, gambling is, you'd be 21 and over, don't you? Or 25, blimey. No, that's definitely 21. 21. I didn't know that. That's interesting, though. Well, yeah, I hope yeah. you've been having a good time regardless. <laughs> yes, yeah, good. I'm, it's my first time in Vegas. You've been here about, about two days, so I'm enjoying it. But you live out here, don't you? Yeah, I live in Vegas. What's it like living out here? Because it seems like a place where, in my opinion, you kind of go for a week every year or a couple of weeks to have a good time. <laughs> well, it's definitely a town like that. And I always recommend when people come and visit, literally like three or four days is all you need. Because everybody just gets up the first day or two and then you don't see them for the rest of the week you lose them yeah, yeah that's right after the first day they're gone but you know when you live here it's completely different you're not out on the strip all the time yeah. you pretty much want to stay away from the strip and all the tourists so it's like anywhere else you just live in your little suburb you know and come to the strip basically to go out to eat because all the nice restaurants are here and to go to shows that's that's pretty much it what do you recommend to go and eat what do i recommend um Let's see. It's tough. There's so many good options. The, the thing about me, Johnny, the bad thing about me is I've got, I've got allergies, so I'm allergic to eggs, nuts, and seeds. <laughs> so it's quite hard. Yeah, that, that would be hard. I don't know, because everything's changed so much since COVID. Yeah. Like, a lot of the restaurants have changed since then. So, uh... A nice steakhouse, I think, it was just a trick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And every casino has their, like, nice expensive steakhouse, you know, whether it's SDK or any of these places. Literally every casino has their, their fancy steakhouse, their seafood place, you know, their Mexican place. So regardless of where you're at, you always get good food. You don't have to walk very far. You know, obviously I'm from London in England and sometimes you might have to walk like, I know, half an hour or get in a car. But in Vegas it's usually like a two minute walk down the road. So it's not, <laughs> it's not too bad. But like I said, we're here at the AVN, AVN Awards for 2023. Are you looking to win anything this year? I'm nominated for a couple awards. Um, I don't know if I'll win, but who knows. I, I really don't pay attention to the awards. It doesn't, it doesn't really mean that much in the grand scheme of things. But, I mean, a lot of people do enjoy them, especially when you first start in the business. It's nice to be recognized for your work. But then I've been doing this for 15 years, so. <laughs> I'm 18. So when I was the age of three, you started. I started in 2006. So. Do you feel that kind of now you've been in for so long, it's just it's an everyday job now. You're just used to it. You kind of clock in and clock out. It's almost a nine to five sort of thing. <laughs> no, I mean, I still do it because I love it yeah. and I'm excited to do it. Once it becomes boring to me or, you know, just a chore or a job, yeah. that's when I'll quit. Do you think nowadays that so many people do jobs they don't enjoy and they should really focus on their passion more? I think the majority of people do jobs they don't enjoy just to, you know, pay the bills, make a living. But that's what I always tell younger people, especially, is like, just start doing something you love early on, because then you're never going to work a day in your life. You know, whether it's whether you're in the cars, you know, gaming, computers, it doesn't matter what it is. Just start doing that while you're young. And then eventually you keep doing it and you're going to build a nice business for yourself. I guess the way to think of it is you do something and it'll lead to something else. You do something, you meet someone, I don't know, you mentioned cars there, you kind of go down to the car factory, you see the car owner, you start talking to him, I guess it's networking, and you build up and up and up. I know, I know you're a busy man, so I don't take too much of your time, but one last question. What do you think your, crazy, your craziest fan experience has ever been? <laughs> You've been in this business a long time, Johnny. Craziest fan experience, man. You know what, the fans are usually pretty cool oh, really? Every, everyone's super nice to me i, I don't know why but most <laughs> you're people you're a nice guy johnny you're most, relatable most people just want to take a picture and say what's up but uh i guess like early on when i when i used to party more when i was younger and got in the business and you'd go out to bars and people would sort of attach themselves to you because they think you're going to get them laid but 
that's not the case. There's not even any girls around. So those fans are always kind of creepy. Okay, that's awesome. Johnny, I think you came across really well in here. So I appreciate your time. Thank no you. Problem, man. Thank it means you. a lot.